Hello and welcome to Clownfish TV. This is a different episode because it's going to be run by the girls. Hello. So it's me, Geeky Sparkles, and Pinky Boo. Yes, I am here because I am affected deeply by this topic. Yes, so we're going to talk about the new Monster High, the movie thing that's coming uh, out this fall from Nickelodeon and Paramount Plus. And it looks about as good as we expected. Yeah, actually, no, I'm actually surprised it looks worse somehow. But we are not the only ones that seem to have this opinion. A lot of people have opinions, and it's funny to me because uh, I dealt with the same thing with the She-Ra show. When it came out, I was like, what the hell is this? These don't look like She-Ra characters, and I got so much crap. And now the people that were giving me crap are some of the people that are mad about this. Yeah. It's true. So before we get into it any further, please like and subscribe. Make sure you're still subscribed. Uh, they have a tendency of unsubscribing and uh, we don't know why. So make sure you do that. Yeah, I've what, 270 by the way too. I forgot to mention that. You can do my woohoo. Okay, you do you, you do your one. I don't watch your, I don't watch your videos. Don't okay. Please. No, I'm not offended. A lot of people don't. <laughs> my my videos, like my channel, has like 15,000. It's very small. Yes, you can see uh, Pinky Boo and Squid King if you go out to the, this is the Clownfish Gaming. Clownfish Studios. Clownfish Studios. I forgot that uh, neon we change the name. It, yeah. Yes, Clownfish Studios where they have gaming videos and you can see them there. So they released these images. Now you said you saw them a couple days ago. Yeah, it's all over TikTok right now and everyone's angry. So. We're gonna look it up. So, and the comments show that that that, that Pinky Boo is correct. So let's zoom in on on this, and we can go up here to the top and see what we have to work with. So we have Blood Good, which was the you know head of the school. Okay, technically speaking, I don't think she looks bad, but I am worried about the CGI head. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, cause like look how it cuts. It doesn't look right like on her actual neck it does not like go up here like i can yeah i'm gonna go and zoom yeah. in a little bit it won't let me zoom in anymore right here yeah it cuts weirdly um your your dad's comment was wait 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 they made the headmistress the uh, the black woman then cut off her head Ooh. <laughs> I was like apparently okay so then we have laguna who's the bestie with bite Comments? Um, I think your comment was, she looks like Claire's threw up. Yeah, actually, I'm just going to pull up exactly what I said when I first saw this. Because um, I had some comments. I had she some did comments. have some comments um, to make to me. Okay. Laguna isn't blue, for one. Also, I'm just not realizing, like, in the comments and stuff, she does look like Doja Cat. Um, but she's in blue, which confuses me because they did make Dracula, Laura, and Frankie and Heath their original colors. So why isn't she blue? I don't know. And her scales are on her shorts. So she's not actually. But she's a salt got water fins fish on her legs. I don't know. But it's funny that this person said about Doja also mentions Millie Martinez, which is what you said. Yeah. We're gonna get there in a minute. Now here's Deuce, the guy with killer looks. I said he looked like a nerd, and I feel like. Cleo would bully him, not date him. I agree with you. And the thing is, it looks kind of like they're trying to go Riverdale with him. Oh, no. He looks like right. a Riverdale knockoff to me. He uh, looks like that me. one, um, I forget his name because I never watched Riverdale. The one yeah. with the beanie. Yes, it's like a Riverdale knockoff. Um, but the killer, the guy with killer looks, which is, uh, you know, up for debate. You can't really tell in this picture. And then we have Draculaura, who now is a sorceress for some reason. Okay. I like the outfit. But it's not Draculaura. That's what I have to say with most of these. Is I like the outfits. Well, at least some of them. But they're not the actual character. And I don't know why she looks like Melia Martinez instead of having black hair with pink highlights. Yes. Yeah, because that's, yeah, so that's where the Melanie Martinez came, where she came from. Why is magical now? She was already a bat. I don't vampire know. Now thing. she's a fantastic sorceress. But she was already a vampire. There's already... A super popular witch character in Monster High, um, Cast of Fears. Yeah, so why the, I, mean, I don't the know. OG fans know that because they're changing. They're changing everything. Uh, Claudine, the leader of the pack, so now Claudine's the leader. Okay. Um. Well, 
<laughs> she looks like the background characters from the CG movies, if you know what I'm talking about. Like the old 2012 ones. Yes. She looks like a background character. Just straighten her hair and give her bangs. Bam. Background character. Yeah, nothing is spectacular. Frankie, the live wire. Okay. She's Frankenstein's granddaughter. Right. You know that from the Freaky Fusion movie. So why is she moving like a robot? Well, these must be like the Frankenstein walk, but still, it's like... She walks normally. She's I know. She's completely fine. The worst problem she has is when her foot falls off when she's doing kicks. Remember yeah. in the movie? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so. well, that was actually in the show, too. It was in the show, too. Yeah, see, Pinky Boo is a longtime fan. She's been watching this since she was little. Like um, three years old. And she has a massive Monster High collection, like a huge collection, even rare dolls. She has it. So when you're talking about target demographic, she'd be it. Um, uh, go ahead. For Cleo. The undead diva. She looks normal. And usually that would be a good thing, right? No, wrong. She's supposed to be dramatic and over the top. And also, why is her outfit only one color? Also, I would like to point out, I'm pretty sure the actress is Jewish and Cleo's Egyptian. So that's a little ironic. <laughs> I would never have thought that of that at all. Um, Heath, the hothead. Okay, well, I thought he looked normal at first, but now I'm actually looking at his face. I'm deaf. Oh, why does he look like Diet Roger Hefley? So then we got Heath, the hothead. Well, I thought he looked normal at first, but, um, hmm, what happened to his spiky hair? I think that's what his flames are supposed to be. But he had flames on top of the spikes. I don't think they're going for, you know, consistency. And then we also, have this... he can't really control his fire. He just lights stuff on fire. That's like... This thing? This well, thing. not now. This and then we got the thing. Eye of Sauron back here. <laughs> so, and then who is... Is it, is it Komos? The creature um, teacher. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. Well, he never existed before. He sounds like a rejected Greek god. It that looks kinda. like, you know, Dionysus? It's like that, but his special thing is children. <laughs> no, I just and think... I'm not talking fertility god. I just think it's weird. Like, I mean, but so now we have a, then, so it's literally going to be like they're in, they're in class because they have a teacher. Well, they were in class. I know, but I mean, but... like, they didn't have the teachers that much. They did sometimes, but like, I don't know. It's going to be Wait, weird. But for... like, why don't they have the iconic, the iconic person I forgot the name of? One second. The iconic Monster High teacher that was. Oh, yeah, there was a teacher. Yeah, there was this one teacher they always had. Uh, Mr. Hackington, is that his name? Oh, yeah, I remember him. I, I don't know how to pronounce his name. Yes. But, yeah, him. He, yeah, he was like a, like a grumpy person. This person, I don't know. Look, look, he's the hot teacher. Yeah, but he looks like he the has The hip that, and hot. He looks like he has that stupid devil horn Snapchat filter on. It kind of does, actually. So, it's not just, it's not just us who think this is a little bit missing the mark. Because a lot of people were making these comments. Um, it's a definite no. My daughter was obsessed with them years ago. And she just laughed when she saw this. The costumes look unpleasant and sad. As is my daughter. It was obsessed with it. Still has a bunch of dolls. Still watches the, vid the, the videos we have. Loves it. And what's your opinion? Um, I'm probably not even going to watch this movie. If I do, it's just to make fun of it. <laughs> That's not Frankie. It was Agatha all along. Gee whiz, Nickelodeon has went downhill. Um, yeah, Doja Melanie, Melanie Martinez. Do you need someone with eyes to design costumes? I happen to have two of them with perfect vision, unlike they were designed, and okay, these sad mockeries of the Monster High IP. People are pissed. No, I mean, I get your pain, people. I totally do. Because, one, I used to watch this with, with Pinky Boo. And, two, I, I went through this with the she with the Shira stuff. Look, why does this look like an advertisement for Party City costumes? Oh, my God, it does look like an advertisement for Party City costumes. Oh, my gosh. It looks really bad. That what was the, the hell is this? One. Can you make Laguna Blue? Yeah. Also, why is her hair rainbow and not blonde? I don't know. And I've seen your boyfriend. 
I've seen cosplayers do better. Yes. Cleo and Claudine got pale washed hard. Yeah. Um, why did you do my girl Laguna so dirty? Should have let cosplayers make the outfits. Oh, yeah. Um, okay. Why is Dracula a witch? Isn't she a vampire? Exactly. She already was pretty powerful. Laguna bestie with bite? Laguna bites? That's what I wondered. I'm yeah, like... Yeah, didn't she, like, literally say in the Monster High movie that she doesn't bite or something? I don't remember. Oh, my OMG, they better not, this better not suck. Hey, guess what? I feel your pain. Been there. So disappointing. Won't be watching. Kind of disappointed. What did they do to Laguna? Frankie and Deuce is a definite no. Laguna is from Australia. Why mess with it? The name Draculaura means she's a vampire, not a sorceress or witch. No one likes Laguna. They really don't like Laguna. Why is it? This is horrible. What? What's that? What's that supposed to be? Is that supposed to be Deuce? Uh, talk about a dead franchise. Yeah, her, Frankie's hair is the most iconic part of the dolls for me. They even changed that. Why the hell is Draculaura a witch? I can't tell who's a student and who's the teacher. Exactly. I said, I thought this dude was like a student or like, um, what was his name? Norman or something? The half normie dude? Oh. Because they all look like they're 30, paying a mortgage and have kids. Yeah, pretty, pretty much. Well, let's look at, let's look at the, uh, here's all. I wanted to read the ones that were the top ones, but they aren't showing up. I know other people are talking about how their kids were big fans of the show and they're like hell no um they're that they have no interest in watching this it's just it the comments go on and on you said you've been hearing about it for days i didn't even see this till today and yeah. i wrote you and you're like oh yeah i knew yeah people on tiktok are mad it's 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 not yep nope hate that what is this yeah okay cleo that's not cleo this one here is yeah it's like also, did they paint her in gold like they did in the mummy? Yeah, it's kind of like they did. Who did who didn't do the research? Dracula is a vampire. Her name is basically Draculaura or Dracula. How is that so hard to get wrong? People are are, are not happy. I was trying to find the ones I saw earlier. Like the most the most Hold on a second. Why you wanna let me go to the most Like I get she was like a vegetarian or whatever, but that doesn't mean she's not a vampire. That just means she had more character to her. Right. Where's where's Goya? Where is Goya? And also, where's Laguna's boyfriend? Oh, Gil? Yeah. Well, apparently not on here. I love Monster Hire since I was 11 years old. I have dolls of them. I watched their TV movies, and I used to play their games on the computer in the, in the past. And now they're a movie coming this year. I'm excited, and I got Paramount so I can watch what's coming. Well, I'm glad you're happy. Um, there's a couple people that are happy. Most people don't. Uh, most people are not happy about this, and uh, I get it. Um, uh, so prepare yourselves to see if people start calling you names for not liking it. Because <laughs> that's what happened with Shira. It's just so bad. I don't know. Anyway, we're wrapping this up. Yeah. Anything else you would like to add? What is there to not add, honestly? What are those shoes? Also, why is Juice wearing, like, a jacket? Wait, the, the jacket, but what, what's up it's, with the camo? Yeah, I mean, but here's the thing. Look, his and glasses, those glasses would... They wouldn't do anything. No, They're it's regular glass. regular glasses. They're not sunglasses. I thought that was weird, too. I don't know. It is what it is. Not looking forward to it. You have also, no plans on watching. A dude playing Frankie. Yeah, it's a trans dude playing a girl. Playing Frankie, yes. Yeah, why is a dude playing Frankie? Because probably on the show it's going to be something about trans character because, you know, that's that, that, that's an easy one they're going to go with because, you know, diversity and inclusion. Uh... All right, well, let's wrap this up. Uh, what were we going to say? I said it's given justice. Oh yeah, this is like justice. Speaking of justice, I was at Walmart today and they make justice clothes for dogs now. I'm not kidding. There's a whole end cap full of justice dog clothes. Still probably better designed than this outfit. You know, Cleo, she's really giving me the princess from the mummy vibes. And I don't think that's a good thing. No. 
All right, we're going to wrap this up. We will talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Now he's just tasty, delicious, rotten flesh meat, which I can consume and don't read into it too much. Just like our museum, the cafe, it's open to brute through it, eager to serve. I don't think this was in the show. No, run, 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 run. Oh, you got splatted. No. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh she was begging and what? you kicked her in the face. I don't care. Hey, guys. Squid King here, and today we're in a- <gasps> Not girl boss, not girl boss at all. She is not a material girl. She is not. Oh, it's Christmas time here in your mom. Nobody wants to join your mom. What? Like, I can't even cook kid cuisine right. I would last about two minutes with Gordon Ramsay. What? Where is he? He's hiding. He's hiding from you. He better. Oh my god, you got the axe. Walker, does this look like Steven Universe? Let me punch him. Well, I'm just here for the wax. Okay. Ah! Right where you belong. Get in the dirt. Well, that was a combination of events I probably shouldn't have put together. Anyways, let's open this bottle too. Chica pinata. Is that official? Oh, no. There's a bootleg. Hello. Hey guys, it's Diamond Tool. Let's make a farm. Like and subscribe and buy my merch. I mean, while you're here, you guys should like really like and subscribe and buy our merch, all of which we have. <laughs> that is true. You can't run them carrying trash. And you can get away with one F-bomb per PG-13 movie. Oh, I wish I'd yeah. known that sooner. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna wrap this effort up. Yes. <laughs>